alive. We I was alive. alive well before. We are alive. I've been alive for alive. 42 and a half years, <laughs> believe it or not. What a hails of a week. One hails of a week. Oh my. Oh Happy my. Oh my. Sunday, everyone. George, you know what I got in my hands? This right here is the guitar that you found. In the, how much did we pay for this unit? $621 after taxes. and some odd cents yeah. after taxes. Yep. And this is the actual guitar. So Ain't I it think pretty? We should do a little work and try and see if it works so we can determine if we resell it or not. What do you think? I think you should play a Christmas song because the season oh, calls for it. Now I'm allowed to play Christmas yeah, songs. Yeah, Christmas is right around the now, corner. Now I'm allowed to play Christmas songs. Um, well, if you get your golden microphone that you found in the same unit <laughs> and you sing with me, then... I found this rose, rose gold microphone in the same unit that the guitar was in. I was going to use this for the mail song, but we don't have mail. We don't have mail. So no, this is don't. the so microphone. Microphone. <laughs> Are you ready? He's so bossy. I'm the bossy one. He's so bossy. It goes like this. Dashing through the snow in a horse open sleigh. O'er the fields we go, laughing all the way. Let me hear your best laugh. <laughs> Bells on Bob's tail. That's spring. kind of Halloween ish. <laughs> Making spirits bright. What fun it is to ride and sing a sleighing song to. I appreciate it, Meg. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a... What are you doing? One horse open sleigh. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. It sounds pretty good. A day or two ago, I <laughs> thought I'd take a ride, and soon Miss Georgie George was seated by my side. Ramses was hurting. He's been through a lot of abuse <laughs> yes, lately. Yes, yes, that's true. A bolt stuck in his tire. <laughs> Donna we... said Jeremy slows that best. <laughs> it's not coming off, Donna. <laughs> we tried to get him fixed. Uh, what rhymes with tire? Fire. Fire. But the tire place should be fired. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Yeah. Oh, what fun it is riding up. Would you get that out of my face? Yes. <laughs> jingle right. bells, that jingle right. bells, jingle all the way. Yeah. Oh, what fun it is riding a one, one horse, horse open sleigh. There you have it, the guitar. Merry this Christmas, is everyone. This is the guitar from the $620, $21, and I forget how many odd cents unit. This is what was inside the case. Pretty awesome. Works well. We got it tested there. And apparently the it mic- works very well. The mic must work well, too, for it to be right down my throat. So <laughs> yeah. that's, a, that's a bonus there. <laughs> we got a lot to cover tonight, don't we? I think I think the, the folks down the hall, the folks- on both ends of the room can hear the us. The folks upstairs, the folks downstairs, mm -hmm. so the they folks get to hang out with us too lot. for the next hour. Yeah, everybody, they're they're absolutely everywhere. So that'll be a ton of fun. Mm -hmm. uh, we have so 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 very much to cover. We do, don't we? How, how do we even get them back on Where track? Where do we even start? What the hails is even going on? Where do we even start? Um, how about last week? Uh, 
before the winter storm came into Ohio, we got in the truck and what did we end up doing? We just started driving south. And we stopped, let's see, we stopped in Elkin, Indiana. Which is North Carolina. And no, it would be Indiana. That's why it's called Elkin, Indiana. And then we stopped in North Carolina. We had a meetup in North Carolina. I don't fan, remember stopping in Indiana. Fan, it was, it was amazing. And, <laughs> and uh, oh wait, that's right. We weren't in Indiana. Um, Elkin, North Carolina. That's what I just said. You did? Yeah. Pound it. And you said no. Elkin, Indiana, <laughs> with confidence. <laughs> Indiana with great sounded confidence. better. <laughs> so we stopped in North Carolina. Elkin, North Carolina. Then we stopped in somewhere in Georgia, right? We stopped in Georgia, but the pool wasn't working. So then we so left then Georgia. We left and Jacksonville was only 45 minutes. An hour, hour and like 15. So we went to Jacksonville and set instead. Mm -hmm. So we ended up in Jacksonville. Yeah. And from there, we decided we were going where? And then from Jacksonville, we decided to come to West Palm Beach area. So we were in so West we're, Palm right Beach. Right now, we're in the West Palm Beach area, but technically we're in Juneau Beach. So technically, we were supposed to be in Fort Lauderdale today. Today, yeah. We were no, originally. No, tomorrow. No, we were leaving today. We had to renew. We had to renew the the room we had to today. extend our stay in okay. the hotel that we're in so for another two days we are supposed to be in fort lauderdale but we are not so plans Yet. completely and totally changed <laughs> yeah because there is a huge how the big? h is silent there's a huge uh, public storage auction run here in West Palm again tomorrow. And uh, we saw a safe. And we also were told a story by the manager that $30,000 cash was found. In one of the units? In a dresser. In a dresser, they found $30,000 cash. Now, Hashtag no counterfeit. Here's, here's the other thing that goes on down in this area, which Donatella could probably tell you best, okay? But what goes down in this area, there's a huge Haitian population. And so what happens, and not only, there's a, a, other populations as well. There's drug money, basically. Thanks, Sherry. So the $30,000 was drug money. We also have heard stories about the Haitians getting guns and firearms and sticking those all and in mattresses. mattresses. And then they ship those in containers back to, ha to Haiti. So we're hoping we get one of those mattresses. Mattresses used to be the arch nemesis. Mattresses now are buying every single one of them after that. Well, we try, especially here in, in Florida. But we tried, remember when we sliced open the mattress to look for money and all we found was coil? That's Ohio. <laughs> we don't have Haitians in Ohio sending weapons over to another country. Flipping for profit, Merry Christmas, safe travels, buy George some hot chocolate. Check out our new channel when, uh, check out the new channel you're when you're killing time, time on, on the road. road. Thanks, Thanks guys. guys, God bless. God bless you. Oh! Appreciate it. <laughs> That was a big one. Yeah, Donatella's in the chat right now, so she can tell you. We need mattresses. We, How things after, are being operated down here in Florida. After that story, we absolutely need mattresses because mattresses are being filled with firearms and shipped over to Haiti. So I, and to money Haiti. too, right? And money and and money. the whole deal. So we found, okay, so Donna is the only one that has video. I don't have video of this. George doesn't have video of this. Donna is the only one who she has, has a very, video. Very, very, very short clip. Very short clip she of me right bidding on a unit with a safe in it. I don't remember how much I bid. I don't remember how much it actually it, went for. You well, the unit sold close to a thousand dollars, and then you tapped out. I think at like eight hundred. Somewhere around there, something. Yeah. So, you you see so many units, you start forgetting what you she, actually saw. Public storage is very strict about recording, taking pictures on their property, and he, the district manager, caught her real quick. District manager <laughs> told her, "You delete that right now." And, and he then stood over her, waited until for she her to delete it. it, but she just brought it right back out of her deleted folder and she still has it if you have an iphone there's a recover folder so her and i went back and recovered it and it was literally like a second not even jc walker just sent five dollars merry christmas jeremy and george merry christmas right back oh, to you jc walker appreciate it thanks jc <laughs>
Uh-oh. That sounds like George. Okay. So we definitely have to go on this run because Sean, the actual manager, told me Invited that this back. was, he's like, this yeah. is the one you have to be on. You have to be on this one. It's the better this run. This is the better run. Yeah. He's, this is, the money is found. Not only that, today, and they... They haven't seen this video yet. You will not see the video till tomorrow. We were at a facility today where they found a $120,000 Cassius Clay, which was Muhammad Ali before he changed his name, Cassius Clay boxing robe in a unit here in Florida, sold it for $120,000. That's where we were today. But you won't see that video until tomorrow. We have so much to cover. Oh my goodness! It's Can, been it's been one hail of a week. I actually sure. I, I I'm thinking right now that I probably should go back up north, get the camper, and just stay down here for a long why, time. Tell them why we didn't bring the camper. Well, the camper originally we we're supposed to be on the road the beginning of January, and the camper hit in state, 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 state. So there's multiple factors of why that's not happening right now. But number one factor is the camper is actually in for repairs. Now, they're just minor, minor repairs. Like, I want a new awning. I want a new awning on it before I take it out. So that, you know, your awnings get get sun dried and all of that. So I got to get a new awning. Uh, there's some soft spots in the floor and I want that rebuilt. By the way, this is what George found in the thrift store shopping mm -hmm. challenge. And that's pretty incredible. I've gotten a couple compliments so far. That's pretty incredible. Here, uh, just so. Show them the, yeah. the pin. They don't know about this yet. They haven't seen the video. You'll see well, the video tomorrow. Like a teaser for tomorrow. You'll see the video tomorrow. You can't read it, but you'll see it tomorrow. If you can't read backwards, it says, cleverly disguised as a responsible adult. <laughs> Dr. Flippant Thrifts McKay says, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year Aww, to you. Thanks, Ray and Debbie. All the way from Texas. <laughs> do you think it's do you think it's warm in Texas? I I did look at the weather because I still had Dallas saved in my oh, really? list of places for weather huh. and they're at about they're about 60 about 60 yeah uh we so were we decent. were mid 70s today as a matter of fact uh i got to pet a pelican today and you got to see a pelican swallow an entire fish whole uh-huh so that was pretty amazing that was pretty cool steve yep. wilson is in the chat what's up steve says wants to know hello you two are you still coming to avon park we, we I, yeah i was right on I the schedule yeah but Avon we Park's don't like know right when. in the middle of Florida. Well, we 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 will we will let everybody know where we're headed headed not headed. Actually, we are kind of headed. <laughs> um, tonight we'll let you know where we're headed next. So we we are not staying here in West Palm Beach. We actually are leaving Tuesday, Ch right? Check out on Tuesday. Kay. So we are checking out West Palm Tuesday. We're we're leaving West Palm and then we're headed somewhere to, somewhere else. We actually already have reservations. So those can be changed because they already have been a million times already. Yeah. Just based on whatever at any point in time. So uh, that will be changed. But Dr. Flip, it says not at night, it's 13 degrees. 13 in West, in Texas. West Texas. You're making me angry. <laughs> that's what 13 degrees does to it us. It makes the Hulk fist yeah. angry. Yeah, that's not a good thing at all. <laughs> not a good thing at all. But we will be revealing where we are headed next. Now, Saturday, do you want to tell everybody what we did on Saturday? Saturday, that was we the meetup. Was the meetup. We did have the meetup with. Um, other storage unit buyers and other resellers um, in West Palm Beach. It was a nice turnout. It wasn't too many people. Um, I feel like too many people would eliminate from us being able to spend one-on-one -on -one time with with um, the people that came to the meetup. But I did post a picture today on both Instagram and Facebook. And everyone that showed. I don't want to brag, but <laughs> if you check out Donna's live of the meetup, uh -huh. I was kicking some butt in some in Yeah, some Donna Connect posted 4. like a 12 minute live. Yeah. So make sure you check out her channel. She's got a 12 minute of the meetup. Preview of the meetup. Yep, of yeah. the meetup. Steve Kelly just sent $2. CDs will be late. I had some family issues arise. Thank you, Steve. CDs. 
And then Brian Walter just sent $5. Thanks, Brian. <laughs> I'm going crazy with that fish. That was one for each dollar. <laughs> that was one for each dollar. Okay. And then, that's not it. We have more. We have more. Becky Winery just sent, check out my new YouTube channel, Storage Smashers of Florida. Of Florida. Storage Smashers <laughs> like this? <laughs> you need to get one of these. You really need to get one of these, Becky. You should Hopefully go into Becky the unit. Hopefully, Becky will find one in a storage unit. Or maybe that could be that could that's actually where we be. Find our fist. This could be your thumbnail. Every single every single one could be like this. <laughs> How, what do you think? That's pretty cool. Becky, we didn't get to see Becky in Florida, did we? I don't know what part of Florida Becky lives in. Okay. All right. Will Smith says. In Northern Ireland, it's 2.15 a.m. there. Whoa. Whoa. In West Palm, Florida, it is, based on my laptop, 6.16. <laughs> but based on reality, it's 9.16. Yeah, you're like on uh, Pacific time or something. FX Diz just sent $2. Merry Christmas, Jeremy George. Aw, Merry Christmas. Appreciate it. Merry Christmas to you as well. I <laughs> Tip my tree. Oh, show everyone your tree. It's kind of cut off right now. It's got the star on the top. It fits them well, I think. Mick Draper just sent a buck ninety nine two hour drive to Fort Myers. Come on over. <laughs> Fort Myers. Yeah. Is that where Mick is? I think so. Are you serious? I think so. Mick, are you from Fort Myers? I think she, I want to say she's from the Fort Myers area. Right next to Sanibel Island? Mick, are you right next to Sanibel Island? Let us because know she chat. said just sent $2.99 towards some new underwear. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I found some holy ones in one of the units. Now remember, if you're just tuning some in, some crusty ones. We too. have to survive off of everything that we find in our units are thrifting, okay? And if we can pawn or if we can generate income mm -hmm. from selling gold or from bartering or trading, mm -hmm. that works as well. And Rick just sent $5 just for all the great entertainment. Aw, thanks Rick, Merry Christmas. I think you may have skipped one. Did I skip one? Let Maybe. me see what I can find. Double check. Let me see what I can, we have so much to do tonight. We've got so much to, okay. Two hour drive to Fort Myers, that was Mick. Uh, we got that, we got that one. We got, I think we're good. Okay. I think we have them all. Right. Okay, so we've bought how many units? We've bought four units so, so far, far in as Florida. of today. We've bought four units. Four units. Now you won't see the fourth one until tomorrow. Yeah, I have to stay we up all night and today. edit that, yeah. and then I have to go on a huge auction run tomorrow, and and then I have to edit that so you can see that. And right now you're thinking, when do you sleep, Jeremy? I don't. At sleep o'clock. Yeah, I don't. In all reality, <laughs> I don't. Locker Nuts just sent $5. <laughs> How much money did you guys bring? Start with your road trip. <laughs> Thanks, Jack. Uh, that is a great question, Jack. Do you know how much money we even brought? I don't. I honestly don't know. Um, I'm, we'll just, we'll sum it up this way. Enough. <laughs> but. That is only for buying storage units that we have to survive off of. And then everything of. else in there we have to so, find. So we'll just say enough, and then you have to survive off of that with storage unit buying. Because we honestly have no clue how long we're on the road for either. Mm -hmm. So you had to bring enough to actually make sure that you're yeah, doing okay. We don't, right now we don't have an agenda. We're just kind of winging it. And this is my first time ever doing this where I'm just like, let's wing it. We don't really have a set schedule. Jonathan Rosberry said, Merry Christmas, Jeremy and George. Woo. No, you Thanks, were not angry, Jonathan. Jonathan. <laughs> okay. And then, Merry Christmas to you too, Jonathan. Merry, Merry Christmas. Okay, Mick Draper just sent, Mick just said, yes, right by Sanibel, Idaho, and Florida, Florida condos. condos. All right, we'll definitely keep that in mind, Mick. <laughs> Do you have any spare rooms? <laughs> Do you Airbnb? Do you Airbnb, Mick? We okay. were, we were, I was actually looking at, I downloaded the Airbnb app and I was looking at 
houses that were Airbnb'd in the Sanibel Island, on Shit. Sanibel Island and around Sanibel Island. And Okay, so since she's already told you that she's looking at Airbnbs, we might as well tell them where we're going next. We're going to Sanibel Island next. Well, so, technically... Technically, we're actually going to Fort, Fort Myers, Myers next. Which is only like 30 minutes away from... Sanibel. Sanibel. So we're going to be in that area. So we're Cape going Coral. we're going to Fort Myers yeah. to spend Christmas on Sanibel. Because the sand there is super white, kind of like snow. We're going like treasure baby, hunting. Baby powder white. So for those who aren't aware, which Mick can, Mick can verify this for you, Sanibel Island is one of the greatest shelling places in the world it's 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 hailed as the greatest place to go shelling and for those of you who say what's shelling it's not like <laughs> hailzing is it no it's shelling it's going and you comb the beaches for the shells and some shells can be worth hundreds and some shells can be worth thousands Isn't that crazy? and so we're actually going to sanibel which is one of the most expensive places to actually live we're going to treasure hunt okay so we will because be we're always on a hunt for treasure always right? always Re you all the resellers i think can relate when you guys are out sourcing you're always treasure hunting like we are steve wilson said he's got a storage unit that we can get in what nice what i wonder if Mick Draper says, yes, Avon spare Park room. Avon is like in and between friends can't where we're leaving. She has soap. Mick has soap. Woo! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> friends condo. Nice. All right. All nice. Right, all right. She has soap. That's better than we're doing right now. We found <laughs> one bar. One bar so far. There's a bar of ivory, I think. Yeah, well, one well. bar. <laughs> one bar. So remember, we have to survive off of what we actually find. That was the whole challenge, that we have to find it, and then we have to either flip it, survive, the whole deal. So it's not about profit per se. It's about survival, survival. out on the road. Yes. And thus far, uh, it's been, it's, Florida hasn't had the essentials that we usually find in Ohio units, like porn. Wait. Yeah, yeah, no, we have we, found, we, we found, yeah, we found porn, yeah. um, we balloons, found toys. we found toys, balloons. Yeah, okay, you know what? They're exactly Never the same. Mind. <laughs> They're the same. They're the same. Uh, we did find. Did we find a Christmas tree? We did find a Christmas tree too, right? Didn't Not we? That I remember. We, pro we probably didn't show it. I thought we found one. No. Well, I guess we didn't find I don't one. Think so. Adventures with the Hubson said, Merry Christmas, Jeremy and George and everyone in the chat. Heat wave in Ohio, 50 Woo, degrees 50. tomorrow. You 50 keep your is 50. actually amazing in Ohio. <laughs> That's amazing right now. You keep your 50, we're still not coming back yet. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Beth and Merry, Jim. Merry Christmas. Appreciate it. <laughs> so we have so much to go over. We have found... <sighs> Oops, I just Ooh. dropped one. We have found so much IT and tech... And actually, this isn't even all of it. One, two, three. Do I, what did I do with the memory card? Four. Oh, the memory we card's found right here. Okay. Four laptops. Well, they only know you only know about three, three laptops so far. so far. If you've been daily watching, you mm -hmm. know about three. But yes, we have found a fourth. But you'll find out about that tomorrow. So the fourth one is not in today's. That mm -hmm. will be in tomorrow's. And Which we'll show you next Sunday. You were able to get number four powered up, yeah. right? Okay, so number four does power up, so yeah. that's cool too. Okay, so let's make sure I didn't miss any. Oh, Jill Presley sent a super okay. chat. Will you be coming a little further north to Tampa? I would love to go to auctions with you. You it, will Jill. have to stay tuned. It's like these people read our minds. Are this you guys crazy. mind readers? Do you what? have a crystal ball that you is found in the unit? Telling, <laughs> is somebody telling our secrets? Deborah just said, you're wearing the Christmas tree. Are we going live when we have these, these conversations, <laughs> these private conversations about where we go next? Because this is, this is weird. Okay, um, so we've got a ton of stuff to cover here, right? Okay, so you did, okay, this was the, this was the DS from the $621 unit. That's all I remember in so odd sense after taxes, okay? Now a DS, you can power on especially the DS. This is- But it's a special type of DS. This is the 3DS XL, okay? Uh -huh. 
Is so, it an XL because it's slightly bigger? The screen's bigger? Is that what you call me your XL? <laughs> yeah. You just call me your X. <laughs> All right. So, so we have the DS right here. And you can take pictures with the DS just like you could a phone. It operates the same Wait, way. Wait, Mick sent another super chat. Okay, what did Mick say? She said something about a soft couch. <laughs> Yes, because this one is horrible. <laughs> this couch is literally horrible. It's bad. He, we had to go to Walmart and get a, a mattress topper. Uh, if Donna is in the chat, Donna will tell you how bad my back has been. So they've given me Tiger Balm uh patches for my back mm -hmm. like light those lidocaine patches her son is lifting stuff instead of me lidocaine patches uh the slightest thing will, will throw my back off so the tiger balm didn't help at all nothing and i helps. caked it on there nothing helps my back and the pads that we the patches that we found the only well we did find we found patches in that was the stolen military bag. It was unit. the. It was, was the that, Jacksonville. That was one hundred and fifty dollars. Okay, that was, that was Jacksonville. Jacksonville. We bought that one in Jacksonville. Mm -hmm. We found back heating pads, and we actually used that. And oh, Donna just sent a super chat. Merry Christmas, everyone! Thanks, Jeremy and George, for all the love. Got to run. Donna's got oh, an Donna, auction coming yeah, up. Yeah, Donna so. has her auction. Boom! Uh, At you ten o'clock, she does her that live was, auction. That was so weak. That was so so weak. Yeah, it wasn't extra. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Okay. So we found the back patches for my back and nothing, nothing Those literally didn't help helped. Either. We had to go, we spent ibuprofen. He ran out of ibuprofen, we so we had ran to ran out of ibuprofen for the um what do you call that? When your muscles, I don't know. For the swelling. Okay, so anyways, hit an ibuprofen like crazy. And then basically went and bought a memory foam topper yeah. from Walmart. So, and that so really far, doesn't do it. Something like that you won't find in a storage unit. So we couldn't wait to, to Had find to do it. that for survival. That was like necessity for Yeah, survival. so we have bought because a topper. Because if he topper. didn't, he wouldn't have been able to, to it, walk. it literally gets to the point I can't walk. Yeah. So, uh, and usually so even. So we get to bend the rules a little bit. Because I will be bent over, hunched over for about an hour before I can even stand up straight yeah. in the morning. It gets that bad. Okay. So Cliff Woods just uh, Cliff Woods just sent five dollars. Stop by the Shell Factory in Fort Myers while you are there. The Shell Factory. Oh, Have you ever been to the Shell Factory? I've been to a lot of Shell places, but I don't remember. The Shell. Factory. We'll have to go check it out. Thanks for the tip. We appreciate it. Okay, we are on to the DS. So the issue with the DS is the XL uh, Nintendo DS XL. These these sell great. Okay, but we did not, and That's we did it. check everything, we did not find the actual charger. So the charger would go in there and it would power up so that we could actually see what's on it. Unfortunately, we can't see what's on this. So that one we have to set aside. Okay. But don't worry, I have all of this, memory cards, and two other laptops still. Let's take a question before we get on to anything else. Uh, El Cubanaso says, I wish everyone a very Merry Christmas, very blessed New Year, filled with lots of love. Aw, appreciate it, Oscar. <laughs> to you, from us, to your family. Thank you so much, Oscar. And Storage, Storage Legend says, Crocker, you get my money for them. <laughs> Karen said, uh, watch taking those pills, they're bad for your kidneys. Yes, he's limiting them and not uh, overdoing it. Uh, <laughs> no, I'm taking a bunch of them. Mick Draper just sent another buck 99. Soap, soap soft, soft couch, couch and muscle, muscle relaxing, relaxing drugs. drugs. <laughs> <laughs> See you later, George. <laughs> Thank you, Mick. Mick is the best. Thank you, Mick. Okay. Oh, someone's saying rub A535, trust me. What is A535? Robert Dennis said rub A3535, trust me. I have no idea. But what I do know, both these cell phones came from the military bag thieves unit. Yeah. So this is the unit we paid $150 for. Then you got fees on top of that percentage. I don't know. You're, you're looking at about roughly $200. So, he, so we, we, after putting 
going through the unit, we figured that we learned that we quickly learned based on paperwork that he worked for a military base. And he was a thief. He was cleaning. fired because of it. He was, he was on the cleaning stealing. crew yeah. and stealing. Which we found some of the evidence in the, in the unit. <laughs> and most shockingly, he had speeding tickets. And, and I don't even think that's, demon. I think he probably <laughs> had overdue library books as well. I'm, I'm almost, I'm almost certain he fits the profile. <laughs> so that being said, we have these two, these two <laughs> cell phones. Okay. So, I sound like people in our, in our comments. Oh, I don't know. Just, I don't know. I'm, trust me. I know these people. <laughs> I know that person would do, do this. Okay. So we have these. These are both from that unit. Uh -huh. They are both ZTEs. Okay. And they're both smartphones. Yes, Jill. He was stealing cleaning supplies. Yes. Because we he, found yeah. like the industrial size, like paper towels. We found rolls of those, which we ended up giving to who? We actually, <laughs> those were great for my big backside, but we gave them to Donna. So Donna could actually use those to clean things up as mm -hmm. well. She's selling and flipping stuff. So we, once we found the actual toilet paper, I thought, well, okay, <laughs> Donna this could be a little for me overkill. to walk on your back. Uh, she has walked on my back uh -huh. nonstop. She actually has to walk on my back all the time for me to even be able to, to get up off the couch. Yeah. I can't even move until something along those lines happens. So, which is going to, going to be rough when, uh, when, when the little, when there's like no little I feel like a little, little Asian lady. No, there's no, no, I don't get that kind of treatment, unfortunately. <laughs> so, so, uh, so we have these two cell phones. Do you want to tell them about the cell phones? You see that awkward <laughs> pause? This is when she's lost. I'm having, I'm having lost. a brain fart right now. She's completely lost. So I give her the segue and then she's like, <laughs> uh, uh. So these came from the thief's unit, right? <laughs> Flippin Adventure says they probably were jaywalkers. And he probably jaywalks. He's probably jaywalker. He's probably, jaywalker. <laughs> He's probably littering, and I think he probably spits his gum out in the road. And it's not even biodegradable. Probably not. Probably not even biodegradable. Okay, so these came from the unit, both ZDTs. You would think with two ZDTs, there would be a charger, right? You would think, think that, right? Yeah. I mean, if you're going to steal a phone, why not steal a charger too? Mm -hmm. We're not saying you stole the phones. We don't know about the phones. We do have paper evidence. <laughs> Remember, we don't show you everything. We were in there all day. You see just a 25-minute video. <laughs> Brian so, said, George, walk like an Egyptian on Jeremy's back. <laughs> she does. Okay, so we found these, and um, we can't power them on. They're dead. So until we can find a charger, which we don't have What's chargers. What's the charging port look like? It looks like, see this? This is the, the old Samsung. So it is, it's the old Samsung charging port. I don't know what you call that, but you can see that there, which my old S, S8 yeah. was before I got the S9, yeah. or I had the so S7. So work on those. But I don't have it because I upgraded to an S9. Oh. I have a, so I upgraded to an S9 after I broke my screen. I just upgraded. You have the C port. And so now I, we don't have these cables. So normally we would have had these cables in the past, but we don't, so we can't charge them yet. We would have loved to because we think there's- They're called micro USB. Thank you, Robin. Is that what it is? Yes. And then you have the new, the new iPhone. I have the lightning takes. charger because I have an iPhone. So these two, <laughs> we can't get into Thomas yet. says, I bet he uses one ply toilet paper. The guy from this unit. <laughs> Probably. Oh, oh, oh <laughs> man. Might as well just use your fingers. Okay, so we have, uh, I don't know, it's anywhere from 500 to 1,000 smartphones. Now, this is when I say this, this is when I get a million requests through email. Jeremy, will you send me one? No, I will not send you one. Don't ask for one. I won't send it. I have no idea if they work. I don't test them. They sit there. I'll do something with them someday, but I'm not going to ship anything that's untested yeah. and broken At to that anybody. point, it's just for parts, and we'd hate for you to receive it and then be disappointed because it doesn't work. Second Chance sent $5. Merry Christmas, everyone. Jeremy's here. Some cash for some raw cookie Ooh, dough. Yeah! Cookie dough. 
Did I get you hip to cookie dough or did you already know about cookie dough? I actually made a post on Facebook about eating raw cookie dough. So that's what he's, he's okay. talking about. So, but the, the, really the person who likes cookie dough the most in this, um, in this live is not me. Who is it? It's both of us. It's <laughs> Really? Because you eat it all. So Every she, time I buy some, like, he'll eat it all in one sitting. The funny and thing, not even save she me. likes to tell everybody that Jeremy's so picky. He's so bougie. I don't even know what that means. I'm the simplest person in the world. I wear the same clothes every single day. I mean, how much more simple does it get that? All I want to eat is a chicken, chicken nuggets, macaroni and cheese, and french fries, or a burger. It's that simple. Or turkey. Her? You like turkey? I have to have... I have to have cookie dough. I have to have cookie well, dough. Well, sometimes I have a taste. I don't say I have to have it. I'm she just in the mood for it. She has to have it. Hangry. I have to have variety. Hangry. <laughs> and I'll drive everywhere to find cookie dough. Although she said today, do you want to tell them what you said I today? I haven't had cookie dough in months. I know. Do you want to tell them what you said today? About what? Where, I said a lot where? of things today. You said, if I'm good today, can we get ice cream? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we are joking. Him and I have a lot of inside jokes. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was right after she and then was... you And then you said too, if I'm good today, can I... Can't repeat it, but... I did not. <laughs> my response was, you're not being good at all. <laughs> Listen to you. There's no way you're getting ice did cream. Did you miss a super chat? No, they're going to go off on that. <laughs> okay, so let's go on to the... We're, the tablet. How, how are we doing on time? Hey, by the way, we're probably going to go over tonight. We got a lot of things to cover, okay? It is. That's oh, Pacific time on your computer. Roger Moore just said, Merry Christmas, Jeremy and George. <laughs> Roger, I don't appreciate you calling me a hottie. I understand the vest looks You're hot. You're a hottie boom body. It's the vest that I makes you. I know it's you, the vest. Yeah. I know it's the vest. Roger. You need to calm yourself down. <laughs> Go get some ice if you need it. A little cold shower. Uh, you know, whatever it is that you think you need, you just bring it down. Fire extinguisher. Turn it down a notch. Just turn it down a notch, okay? <laughs> All right. Just Chillin' says, you guys rock. Just Chillin', you rock as well. And let's see. Uh, let's, let's get into this. Let's Pat get Walling into this. said, cookie dough ice cream at Dairy Queen. Ooh. Dairy Queen, hands down, is like one of the best ice cream places. You can't go wrong. Flippin' Adventure said, you know that saying, if you can't be good, be good at it. <laughs> She's so... I'm good at a lot of things. She was so... <laughs> uh, I get in trouble if I even repeat it, but she's been... Uh... She'd been feisty, that's for sure. Okay, so... Um, Do Dolly wants to know, Georgia, to bring me cookies. Did you bring cookies for me yet? No, Dolly. I was going to make you cookies if you came to the auction that one time. And I think you got busy and couldn't come. <laughs> On to the tablet. Where did this tablet come from? This came from... That one came from... This isn't the... today's. Today we found two tap. One was brand brand new in the box. Yeah, it was but, in the wait, box. Wait, wait, don't. That's tea. Okay. Yeah, I shouldn't have said that. Okay. The, that these are not the tablets we found in today's unit that you will see tomorrow. Okay, but this was from the guitar unit. This had to be from the guitar unit. Remember the unit yeah, that we, we were didn't at find today. Any tablets from the, the unit we were at today is the same location. Somebody bought a storage unit and they found a Cassius Clay, which is Muhammad Ali uh, boxing robe. They sold it online for hundred and twenty thousand dollars. That's where we were at today buying, and we got the unit today for sixty dollars. But you won't see that till tomorrow. Yeah. This was. This was in the $621 unit. Again, that's with taxes. I can't remember the what we actually unit. paid. The guitar yeah. unit. We'll just say the guitar unit. Because we didn't find any tablets from the safe unit, the safe and trunk unit. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. yeah. Yep. The safe and trunk unit. Yep. Mm -hmm. I already forgot all about it. Or maybe we did. Maybe this is from that. Maybe. Okay. So this is either from the guitar unit or from the safe and trunk unit. We can't remember. Were there tablets in there? Maybe you guys know. Do you guys remember? Were there tablets in the safe and trunk unit? I know the laptops were in the guitar unit. Let me see here. Let me see what they say. Um, Rob Whitley says, what's up? Hi, yo! Uh, Rick Munyon says, I love your show. Rick, 
we think it. We actually can't stand our show. It's it gets on our nerves. <laughs> it gets on our nerves. We don't watch it. We're not sure why anybody else. Does. I go back and watch it. Uh, well, she does. I don't. I <laughs> I can't take it. I can't take it. Um, let's see. My parents had a mind. Hi guys. Hi there. Uh, you look cute with that hat, Jeremy. You too, George. Don't remember brain Thanks, farts Dale. again. Somebody else is having brain farts too. <laughs> Debbie Vaughn is having brain farts. Debbie, yes. And uh, Debbie mentioned earlier, we all have brain farts. Take the same charge. The, yes, storage plunder says take the same charger as the phones, which is correct. Uh, how's it going, Eddie Kai? Kind of I watch you all the times on YouTube. Merry, Merry Christmas. Papa Summer said Merry Christmas, Aaron Smith. So Aaron Smith is in there. Okay, uh, I don't see anybody recognizing this from the safe and the... So it's probably the guitar unit. So probably the guitar unit. So this is an LG tablet, right? And as already has been stated, takes the exact same charger. Mm -hmm. And unfortunately, and we've been trying to keep the cords from any of the <laughs> units that we actually Charlie buy. Charlie says better brains than other areas. <laughs> that was good, Charlie. Oh, Charlie, that really hot. Okay, so this tablet... We could not charge. It will not power up. Okay, so I've got the power button right now pushed in. Will not power up. And we're not going to be able to figure out what's on this one because we can't charge it yet. Yeah. Does so it we're going to have to find a charger in, the, in a unit. We have a huge run tomorrow. There's like 200 units posted right now. Mm -hmm. And it's supposed to be the best. And so doesn't mean we're not going to buy and we're not going to figure it all out tomorrow and then have more to share with you next Sunday, okay? And remember, we still do, by the way, there is stuff here, okay? You saw this and we are gonna share it with you. There is stuff there. Not only that, I actually found this today in, in a computer as well, out of the three computers. We're gonna take a look at this too. But, and we're gonna look at the three computers. That's why we have so much. I got a computer right here on my lap. There's two more computers over there. All right, you gonna be ready to grab? Yeah. You'll probably be all right, okay. <clears throat> Okay, here we go. Um, what about the, Justin Brown, what about the laptop? We're getting to the laptops. We have three laptops to go through tonight. Three. Cat, Cat Walling wants to know what are we doing with all this stuff? The same thing we do with everything. Nothing. So anyways, <laughs> that being said, we're not, we don't video it. We don't show it to you. We don't sell, we don't do anything. We're giving it to Donna. So we're actually giving it to Donna to sell. And some we have There's donated. There's a couple things that we've kept. Some we've donated. Mm -hmm. Some we've kept, for example, the guitar, uh, the sound system, the expensive sound system, all yeah. the electronics. All the electronics that we have friend were from. Obviously. Like all the coins in the lockers. We're all the coins that we for, need it for the We have to survive. Yeah, so to do that's, laundry. That's laundry money right yeah. there. So this challenge is survival. It's not how much money can we make. It's how can we survive on the road with the things that we find in the units. You have to keep that in mind. So a lot of people were going off when we sold the gold. The gold Jesus. The people in the comments are going off. You got robbed. You got, I can't believe they only gave you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold a second. Number one. One is a pawn shop. We know how much gold is worth. <laughs> it's not like we just jumped into this. We know what gold is worth, okay? Usually we are going to sell directly to the refinery. We're going to get the best price. Number two, it's a pawn shop. Their business is to give you a low price. Yeah, they're not going to give Number you top Number three, dollar. we did it on purpose because that's part of the challenge. <laughs> And, and it people, paid for the unit paid and for everything. The, and paid more. for the unit. You've got people going some, off. Like, yeah. how dare the pawn shop? I'll call the Better Business Bureau. <laughs> they probably are jaywalkers and use one ply. <laughs> it's okay. Everything went the way it was supposed to go. Yeah. Okay? All right. So we do have this beautiful Samsung tablet as well. Right? Mm -hmm. And they probably can already figure out the direction this is going because... The phones take a Samsung charger, and guess so what the tablet that takes. One. Okay, again, the we mini do USB not, charger. We do not have a charger yet. 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 We hope to get one tomorrow in the auction run, uh -huh. and it's a huge auction run tomorrow. Huge. 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 And it's supposed to be the best. And remember, last time they found thirty thousand dollars in a dresser. And yes, it was drug money. And this is a heavily drugged area mm -hmm. and a heavy area of firearms that are sent over to Haiti. There's a huge Haitian population, and that excites me. So I can't <laughs> wait to bid on mattresses. Okay. Thomas says, "Hey, Jeremy, I have a I have a charge." 
Hales, yes. Where do you live? So, where do you live? <laughs> okay, we're gonna send that one right over there. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. We have the HP, and we have two Dells. Wait, yeah, we have two Dells. So we got an HP laptop. Oh, someone laptop. confirmed that we got the iPad from the guitar unit. FX okay, okay, the iPad. Yeah. So the tablets were from the guitar unit. Okay, good, thank you. We appreciate that. What happens is when you buy so many units, it's so difficult to remember what came from it where it all in. blends in. Yeah. When you do this every day and you see hundreds and hundreds of units every week from profiling to live auctions to online, it all blends in. It's so hard to remember <laughs> it. Justin Brown says, I'll give you a hails of a charge. <laughs> Well, Merry Christmas to you, too. <laughs> okay, so on to the HP, all right? Uh, we got 850 plus in here right now. Merry Christmas to you all. We're going through all the information we have found so far. We have announced that our next location, well, if you haven't figured that out yet, you'll just have to well, rewind. Well, if you're just, rewind. just tuning in, we still will be in Florida, but we, a different part of Florida. We are going on a major, huge run tomorrow. In, in West Palm, and we are on the beach today. That was cool. And then it will be on the run all day tomorrow. Then we head over. Uh, the plan is to spend Christmas on Sanibel Island. So, mm -hmm. and we'll be from, in like the Sanibel, Fort Myer Island. F Fort Myer. Fort Myers we'll be area. in Fort Myers. Yeah. We couldn't get a place on Sanibel this short notice, but then uh, we'll be in Fort Myers and then over to Sanibel. Yes. So, we have no idea what we're going to buy tomorrow. Tomorrow you will see another auction unit, but we have three laptops. We've got a DVD and we still have a memory card to go through. And this is from, this is from the Thieves Oh wait, unit. that just reminded me when uh, someone asked what we're doing with all the stuff from the storage units. We're keeping some of the stuff for survival, obviously. We've donated a lot. Speaking of donations, we get a lot of uh, pushback when people find out that we donate to Goodwill. But when I went to go donate some stuff to Salvation Army, they would not take any of it. They told me yeah, they so would take Salvation any of it. turned us away. So um, I went to Goodwill and they took everything. So the major issue why people push back on Goodwill is because the CEO's salary has been released. The reality is, is any CEO of any nonprofit salary is released. My salary when I ran a nonprofit was public information. That's part of being a nonprofit. So the funny thing is, is people go, oh, Goodwill isn't a nonprofit. Well, the fact that the CEO's salary is released is under the definition of nonprofit. Number two, if you had the skill and if you had the ability to build that business the way the CEO has, you'd be worth every penny you were being paid as well, period. That's it. And because you don't, you complain. Number four, or letter C, well, I don't care, wherever you want to go. But those that have complained. So all that being said, other people cannot take our volume of donations. Yeah. Done. Deal. When you're running our business, you can decide where the donations go. Yeah. But until you have to deal with our issues, if you complain about us donating to Goodwill, you get blocked and you so, get deleted on so, the channel. So something to keep in mind is if you want to donate things, Goodwill seems to be the only charity in our area. And we found out here in Florida. Same thing here. Salvation the, Army turned us away. Yeah, they turned us away because we had too much. Yep, wouldn't so, take it. So the volume. So and then They actually people, told you to go where? Yeah, they told me to go to Goodwill. Go to Goodwill. I said, help me out here. I'm not even from Ohio. I'm just, I bought, got all this from a storage unit. How do I get rid of it? He's like, go to Goodwill. So that kind of upset me. And then back in Ohio, there's certain charities that'll cherry pick and only take certain things. So again, they won't take everything that we have to donate, which kind of is upsetting because you're trying to donate nice things and they won't take and it. I love Goodwill. So that being said. <laughs> so keep that in mind if you're a reseller and you want to donate that Goodwill seems to, Goodwill seems to be the only charity that'll accept the volume and aren't cherry pickers. They'll take anything. And keep in mind, if you complain about us donating to Goodwill, we have a no tolerance policy on negativity, complaining, anything. You'll get blocked and deleted. All right. And then you'll write us a message and you'll say, please, please don't block me, please. <laughs> All right, so that being said, we Wait, have Jonathan, the HP. Jonathan. Oh, Jonathan Rosberry. Amen, preach it, brother. All right, here we go. Here we go, Jonathan. Appreciate it, Jonathan. 
for those of you who think that was too tough, that was tough love for you this Christmas. Terry says, why can't people just be happy or donating? Haters are going to hate. I know. The a funny lot of thing people is, in the chat are saying they love Goodwill. Oh, my goodness. I love Goodwill. Mm -hmm. You wouldn't awesome. have that shirt right now if I we didn't go to yeah, Goodwill. I wouldn't have this right now if we didn't go Goodwill shopping. And here we go. And the these HP. hats. And these hats. Goodwill. I wouldn't have this super sweet vest <laughs> that a subscriber has already offered $40 for. This thing if, is worth more than 40 If I didn't buy that super sweet thief unit <laughs> who probably jaywalks and uses one ply. HP, you ready? Uh-huh. So this is a beautiful, beautiful laptop. Uh, it's not the most recent. It is a mobile workstation. And it's got all the bells and whistles in it, okay? So the only issue with everything else I've shown you so far. You want me to start grabbing the other We thing? had a million cords, and we went through all the cords. Guess what? We do not have one for the HP. But never fear. We have two more laptops that we do have cords for. I'm going to pass that off to you. Island Thrifts. Island Thrifts. Come back up to Cocoa Beach and say hi. So I told her that we drove past Cocoa Beach from Jacksonville to West Palm. Did we? Didn't you hear us beeping? Beep, beep. Yeah, Cocoa Beach is like in between Jacksonville and West Palm Beach. That wasn't us beeping. That was George <laughs> Farton. That was George Fusen. She was like... <laughs> okay, so George is actually grabbing. I don't know. Oh, do you have to keep it plugged in? Yeah. You're going to have to keep it plugged in. Okay, so apparently one of them has to be plugged in to have she's grabbing them now because they are plugged in because we started them up and we matched the plugs with the actual laptops now remember these three laptops as we have 900 on right now these three laptops were from the guitar unit which is where this guitar is from that we started well, out die tonight if I unplug yours? yes mine will die if you unplug mine so but I you can plug in right there okay plug in right there so the guitar unit so we have the guitar right here. We had the three laptops in it. And one, we had nothing as far as plugging it in. All right, and then the next one. Now this is, I love laptops. I love laptops that are extra wide, right? Some of you probably understand that. This one is plugged in right now. This one is an HP as well but it actually has a Dell cord in it. So we had like five Dell cords and the Dell cord actually powered this one up. Now this is an extra wide screen. I appreciate that. My hands are huge, okay? I have huge hands. I need the bigger, I need the bigger space for typing and the screen and the whole deal. You can see the circle light on us right now. So, when we get into this one, this one was shut down inappropriately, right? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna click enter and we're gonna see what happens as we start Windows. I've been in here once already and then it shut down. What, I, what happened, I found this DVD in here, okay? I also found, oh, where's the memory card that was in here? It's right here. It was right over there. Okay, I did find a memory card in this laptop as well, eight gigabyte, but that being said, didn't find anything on that memory card. And then I heard it spin in this. I haven't looked at this, okay? Now we have been just briefly on the screen and then it was shutting down weird. There are a million things on, see this? There are a million things on this home screen and you see the line as well. We have not looked at anything, but I can see right now these are movies. The Texas, Deep Cove, Goodfellas, Shot a Seat of Something. It definitely looks, it looks like there was porn on here, okay? Um, now what happens is, and I, and I don't think there's any doubt whatsoever, there's probably porn on here. Um, there's a tube M button down here as well. Let's see if it'll come back up. Okay, so what happens is it jumps up on this Power DVD 10, which is an older program, Cyberlink. And what happened last time, so I saw everything on the screen, and then what happened is it just froze up on the Power DVD 10. That's when I took this out, not knowing what this was, 
and we've been trying to power it back up and get back on that screen. There is so much stuff here. So much on this screen, okay? Let's see, let me see if I can get out of here. Let's see if we can get out of the Power DVD 10. See, and what's happening is it's spinning again. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna set this one aside, and can I grab this one? Yeah, but careful, because if you switch user, it'll show his name. Yeah, okay. Is so, it long enough? Can you give me a little bit more of a cord? Yeah. Is it long enough? I think we both know the answer to that. All right, so this one is an actual Dell, okay? So this is the third laptop. This is an actual Dell. We found three Dell cords, but there was only one Dell laptop, okay? So this is a Dell, and it does power up, but we had to switch the user because the username is actually his name, and this is a business laptop. So it tells you the business he worked for, it's the login, the business he worked for, and his name. The business, and then name, and then it asks for the password. So we switched it over to the guest user screen, and into the switch, switch user. We just haven't gotten into it yet. We haven't created a profile to get into it. So this one does power up. We do not have his password. We'll have to do a backdoor to get into everything. We'll have to ask Suburban Beard how to do that. Control, Alt, Delete. Can you try Control, Alt, Delete at the same time there and see if, I forgot that old school thing there. So this laptop is up and running. But again, we're not gonna show you his name or his business, but that's the, that this one is up and running. We haven't been able to get in, but the other laptop, it doesn't have a password. So you can get, boom, right there on a screen. And there's like, there's like 50 movies right there on a screen. It's crazy. And some of them are a little risque. All right, so George is control alt deleting right now. Let me make sure I didn't, it froze up. Okay, bring it back over, let me show him. Okay, so this is where it went last time. So it froze up right here on the Power DVD and then action required. I'll, I'll get a little bit closer. I'm not sure if you can see it or not. Action required and talks about different things in here and it freezes up right here, okay? So it says threats detected and it freezes up right there. But that's as far as we've gotten we can see the things on the home screen. We haven't been able to open any of them, but I was able to get this disc out of there, okay? And we still have this memory card. This one is from the thief unit. This is from the guy who jaywalks, who doesn't return library books on time, who uses <laughs> one ply, and probably doesn't kiss his mom on holidays, okay? And there is stuff on here. So we, we are gonna show some of that. Uh, uh, so, okay, just to make sure, we got through the DS. We, we got through the DS. We got through the two cell phones, the, the two tablets. tablets. We got through the three, the three, three laptops so far. Keeping in mind that there is a fourth one, but we found that today. You'll see the video tomorrow. Mm -hmm. There are two tablets we found today, but you'll see one that tomorrow. New. One is brand Still new. Still in the box. Beats audio. <laughs> okay. So, what we need to do then... So what we do, so that we can see your chat, I have you on the chat right here. Look how clear and crisp Whoa. the stream is. This is crazy. But what I'm gonna have to do, I was hoping to use one of those laptops to put the memory card in and show it to you, but uh, we're gonna have to use my laptop. Mm -hmm. So, are you sure you're ready for this? Mm -hmm. We've already looked at this, are you sure you're ready for this? Oh, I didn't see what was Oh, there. I didn't tell you about that? No. Okay, let's move that one out of the way. This and is nothing? That is nothing. Would I you already... like another drink? <sighs> After what they see on here, we might both need <laughs> another drink. Okay. So, all that being said, we've got more to go. Okay? And I know, I know we're at our hour. We're going to keep on going because we promised you during this time... Oh, and by the way, George George at Taking a Risk usually would go live right after us. He has food poisoning right now, so he is not able to go live. I encouraged him to still go live from the actual bathroom. From and the porcelain. From the porcelain throne, but I told him, I said, you could get the golden mic 
from the porcelain throne. The acoustics would be incredible, but George George just wasn't feeling up to it tonight. So we're gonna go a little bit later because we've got so much to cover. So just, just a summary of where we've been so far. We are gonna see what's on this CD, which was in one of the three laptops. We are gonna see what's on this memory card. This, I have no clue. We haven't even looked at it yet. We just got it out of the laptop 30 minutes before the live. This, we have looked at. This is from the Thief unit. We know what's on it, okay? So we're in Florida. For those who are just jumping on, we're in Florida. We have bought four units so far. We are still in, we are still in, we're in West Palm Beach. We go on a major, major run tomorrow. We're staying just to go on that run. And we're about to throw this bad boy. You know what? Which do you guys want to see first? Do you want to see the CD or the memory card? Type a one if you want to see the CD first and type a two if you want to see the memory card first. Let me know which one you want to see first. I want to know which one I should put in. Let me know. One for the CD, two for the memory card. Okay, I've seen ones already. One for the CD. All right, Tina wants to see this. Rogue Life wants to see this. Uh, a couple twos. Ones, Rogue Life. Oh, Rogue Life is going crazy on the ones. <laughs> Dale Abbott says three. I guess he wants to see both. Uh, I think, okay, Debbie Vaughn says one. Brad says one, two, one, two. Oh, now all the twos are coming in. Okay. <laughs> Uh, so he said, somebody says really crappy about George George. But um, bump, ching. Oh, I see what you did there. <laughs> okay, there was, it was overwhelming ones, and now food, I'm seeing overwhelming. If you guys twos. have ever had food poisoning, it is no joke. It is serious. So okay, prayers out to George George. It was overwhelming ones, but I'm seeing overwhelming twos now. So we're gonna go. So Philly says Juan. <laughs> we're gonna go with the actual memory card first, okay? Because this is. This is what's going on. They, it looks like overwhelming too. So this is, if you send a super chat, I'm not gonna be able to see it because it'll be on the laptop. So this is a 32, see there, scan disc. I know it's, it's probably not all that clear. I'm gonna have to pop it in, okay. Pop it in. I'm gonna pass that off. Let's, let's, We'll move the golden microphone out of the way too. Thank you very much. It's rose Thank gold. Thank you very much. And you let me like pull. It. We found it in a storage unit. All right. In the guitar unit. Oh, Mick Draper just sent a buck ninety nine. Come, Come to visit. visit. We'll see what the hail. See, will my what the hails Xmas. <laughs> you want to give her the. You got it. I got to okay. pull up. I got to pull Appreciate up all it, this Mick. info. We'll see you soon. <laughs> there, I got it. Did I do it right this time? That was not the actual fist. Did it meet your fist. expectation? That was her being hangry. That was not the fist. I just want to clarify. Okay. All right. I'm pulling up. Right now, I am pulling up File Explorer. They love the mic. File Explorer. What do we do with the memory cards once we go through them and delete what's on there? They're sitting in a pile for you to sell. Yeah. So what I'll probably end up doing is I'll end up bulking them, doing like a lot. Like we've got flash drives and then memory cards. Okay, yeah. now hopefully I don't screw anything up with all these wires. Actually, let me go, let me go extremely large view so they can see this. There are, we're gonna go extra large icons. There are two files on this memory card, okay? So you can see them right there, and they're files from taking pictures, okay? So this was actually, this memory card was part of camera, taking pictures, the whole deal. Now, what I have to do, I have to find the pictures that I can share with you. Keeping in mind, this was from the thief unit. And one of the things we wanted to know, would there be evidence? This is my first time seeing this. I haven't shown it to you, have I? No. We wanted to know, would there be evidence of thievery on this actual, on this actual memory card? So, um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pull up pictures that I can show and we'll work our way through. Okay. okay. So, I got I to gotta sort through a little bit because... If, if you've ever bought a storage unit and you've ever found things, you, you would understand that uh, there are many things that are not what we would consider 
appropriate and YouTube would not consider. Would be family friendly. Yeah, exactly. Okay. So this one's, this one's innocent enough, right? This one is just a room, right? There's some clothing in a chair, right? Okay. So that one's an innocent enough. You, you can see the room, clothing and a chair. And actually, I think we actually found some of that clothing. And then we find out that room isn't just any old room. That room is a hotel room. <laughs> hotel, that, motel, that room is holiday. the hotel, motel, <laughs> motel room with the bag on the edge of the bed ready to go. Now, can anybody guess what could be in that bag? If you could, just go ahead, put the guesses Let in us, the comments. Yeah. Put your guesses in the comments what's in that bag, okay? <laughs> Susan Stryker says, no tell hotel. <laughs> uh, actually, they could have. Hotel, I don't, if they would have saw, if you would have really holiday, looked behind yeah. the bag, there's more stuff behind the bag, and you would have gotten a little bit of a Looks glimpse. Looks like footlocker bags. Okay. Like they went shopping and got some shoes. Now, here's the crazy part. Who takes bathroom pictures of your hotel room, right? Not I. Uh, it's all leading up to something. <laughs> okay, so we got bathroom pictures now of the hotel, no tell, motel, all right? And, just wait. All right. Um, <laughs> I can't even. I can't. Are we I can't get... Should we show them that? I don't think I don't. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. Okay, next picture. Next picture. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> oh, no. 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 No, you can't. You cannot see. We can't show you that one. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Yeah, definitely no. That would be a hard negative on the next one. My Christmas one. tree just went. <laughs> okay. All right. But don't worry. There are more. Okay. So here is one I can show you. This so we'll, we'll, ca we'll call it before what we were just looking at. And now we will call it the after. Okay. <laughs> so this is the same room, same hotel room, the whole deal. And we will call that the after. All right. One of the afters. <laughs> Okay, we got, we got to, I'll show you this one really yeah, quick. One. This is, this is another one of the bathroom. It's, I don't know why it's in the after one, but it, it's, it's there. Don't worry, there's more. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> this is the most disturbing, okay? You should definitely show them that I can one. show you this. This is the disturbing part, all right? And, and, and we understand that a lot of our viewers are vintage, and so there are needs for special, mm -hmm. special p tools, equipment. equipment, appliances. And um, this is what was set up in the shower. Can I share with you that this person was not vintage, not vintage. and they did not need this for a disability, <laughs> but they definitely used it for other things, okay? <laughs> All right, so. So okay, this is this is still in the hotel, <laughs> and we're not we're not done yet. We're not done yet. Okay, um, there's the. <laughs> do I dare? No, absolutely. Just, what not. if I do quick? What if I just go up really quick? No. Just quick. No, because someone will freeze frame it. Just quick like that, <laughs> like that. Can I do it one more time? Quick. No. Quick like that. <laughs> did Did you all see that person in the bed? Okay. Just can I can I go a little bit faster? No. Just, okay. All right, she's not going to let me, but that was a very sensual come hither look. Okay. Um, and, oh, yeah, we probably, yeah, we no. can, yeah. We, no. Let's just say they added animals into the mix, okay? Um, we can't even cover it, can we? Okay. We can't. I can't look away. <laughs> this is horrible this is horrible okay we've got more we're gonna show you more i just have to get to the point where i can actually show you oh my goodness that poor horse oh my goodness that poor horse okay we will get there i promise we will oh, get there there's dates on the pictures there are there are these Whether are from accurate or not it's got to be well maybe not these are from december 17th 
2015. Is that 15 or 16? It's 15, right? Oh, okay. It looked like a six from okay, over here. Okay, it's 2015. We're not done yet. We're not done yet. Okay. Um, we're going to give you this, this one. This one will show the date, but this one is innocent, okay? So 12, 17, 2015. This was probably one of the places that was nearby the actual hotel room, okay? And... And that one was innocent, but there's more. There is more. Kenny says, George is killing me. The look on her face. You think that face is something? Look at this there. face right here. Again, another innocent one. This must have been, they were getting together. They were meeting up. They were, they were in their hotel, no-tell, motel. And then they were out and about. But don't worry, it gets crazier. Okay. And. Is that a tree? Yeah, uh, it's a, it's, it's like a, it's not a real tree, but yeah, it's a, it's a fake tree, probably some type of amusement or something along that, that line. Um, <laughs> I did not remember that. I did not remember that. Oh my God. Okay. All right. Let me get past that. Okay. Let me, whoa, let me get past that. Okay. This one, this one's innocent enough. This one is of a Christmas tree. We can show you this one. So that is of a Christmas tree. Okay. We're okay there. All right. Remember, we still have we still have this to go to Someone's from another that's unit. At Epcot. I don't Disney. know. I don't know that this looks like Epcot. I don't know. Orlando. Orlando's so well, close. Well, it would be close, but Oh, there's another giant Christmas tree. Here, I'll show you this one. It goes back and forth from the Notel Motel to to out and about stuff, okay? Here's a giant Christmas tree, okay? And that was disturbing with the horses. Yeah. We have to delete this. Okay, um, let me see. <sighs> More animals. More animals. <laughs> I never thought Florida would do this to us, but here we are. Okay. The weird. So when people ask us what's the weirdest thing we've ever found in a storage unit, it's the things that we find on these thumb drives. Uh, it can be extremely odd. Oh, okay. It, this one's this one's innocent. Yeah. This is an innocent animal picture. There's just wait. This is an innocent animal picture. This is like the pelican that I that I pet today. So this is just Which one is of the. Florida wildlife. Uh, if you haven't checked out our stories on the YouTube channel, check out the story. Today I put a story out there of me actually petting uh, a pelican. We were on a fishing pier. It was awesome. And oh no. <laughs> the... that, yeah, no, no, we're not showing that. Did you even get a glimpse of it? Yeah. Okay. Let me see what else I can actually show. No, no, no. This is whole. Just <laughs> can I do a glimpse? No. Just quick. No. Just let me do it quick. All right, I have to be really quicker before I get in trouble. That was quick. Okay. All right, that was quick. So, if if you were quick enough, you would see the disturbing poses. <laughs> Those were the individuals that were in the disturbing poses. That was, if you were quick enough. And, and let me see what else I can share with you. And holy cow. Holy cow. Oh, it's, it's nighttime. Did you see that? It's nighttime again. The leaf. Why would they take a picture of that? The leaf is right in um, this picture that we're looking at. The leaf is perfectly placed. And what would you say? 400 pound man? This in is the hoo-hoo area. This is a 400 pound man with a leaf in the hoo-hoo area, perfectly covering it. And she's not going to let me show you that. Holy cow. Okay. And... Uh, all right, you know what? <laughs> it's not getting any better. I think it's time. Do you guys think it's time? Mm -hmm. Let's see what's, are you okay with that? Mm -hmm. Can we go here? Okay. 
So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna close that down. I, I've gotta see some of their comments. This is gonna be hilarious. Okay, uh, Kathy White just put a bunch of pickles. Yes. Uh, a bunch of cucumbers. Terry Saul says, Georgia's face, oh my, Virginia budget, crazy. <laughs> uh, Catherine, you guys are hilarious. Book lover says, Georgia's blushing. <laughs> She's caramel. Are you, but actually you are. Yeah, you can see me blush a little bit. Yeah, yep, you are. <laughs> Uh, Deb, Deb Ann said, well, Deb Ann would have been right in some of the pictures. Um, George's face stayed that way and Georgia videos. Okay. Let's check out the CD. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. I think I have an idea of what this is. I don't. I do. I found this in one of the laptops, not the same individual. Keep this in mind. Not the same individual. This okay? is from the guitar unit? This is the guitar unit. This is in one of the three laptops. It's the one that froze that has all the videos on the front, the front page. Which some of them look like, you know, typical. You know what I'm saying. Um, I think Grimes Fine says, don't look at other hoo-hoos. Something like that. <laughs> okay. Yeah, he says hoo-hoos. Because I thought it says? was a chocolate drink. Okay. So I thought too. All right. I'm popping it in right now. Now, don't know what's going to happen, <clears throat> and don't even know after I had the guy repair. Italian Dragon says, George is shining like Rudolph's nose. Here, let me get that grease. <laughs> there we That's go. That's just because I have a sh an oily face. Okay, we have almost nine, okay, 900 on, and okay, I'm pulling it up now. You got you to gotta give me a moment here on the laptop. Because it wasn't in there. File Explorer. And where is it? Where is it? Where is it? <laughs> Veronica say? says you can't unsee those pics. No, Veronica, nope. we cannot. <laughs> no. Nope. Neither can my hat. <laughs> my hat used to be like this, and now my hat now is like, like this. No <laughs> Jeremy. No Jeremy. Okay. Um this PC. Oh, local disc. Here we go. All right, I'm pulling it up right now. I just clicked on it. So we're going to find out. Welcome to Media Player. So you know what Media Player is? What? It's audio. So scroll down or move that out of the way. Yeah. Or X out, either okay, one. Okay, let's X out. See where it says audio CD? Oh. Yeah. Okay, I'll click play. We'll see what happens. It takes it. Okay. So... We just found out this is what we had come up, okay? This is what we had come up. It's an audio, audio CD. We don't know what kind of audio. So it's it was a burn CD. I guess I don't even have, I probably don't have media player on here, do I? <clears throat> probably not. Because that was probably such an old, that would probably, okay, so it was probably so old, media player probably isn't even on my laptop anymore. Interesting. Got wiped out. Sherry Brown said, "I bleach. <laughs> I bleach." That's right. Oh my goodness! I so the crate. Here's the best part, though. It doesn't end here. Once we find the actual cords, we're gonna still try and get into those things on the road. The things that we couldn't get into yet, and share those with you. And we have another laptop, and we have two more tablets, and we go on this major, huge auction run yeah, in it's Florida. Yeah, it's a caravan. Tomorrow. It's a caravan. In the richest areas in the world. So one of, one of the things that Donna has told us is President Trump lives right down the road. He's got a house right down the road. What else have we learned about the area? He either stays in Jupiter or Juno, one of the two, which we're in Juno. So he stays in Jupiter, I think. He has a house in Jupiter. And the run is, it's West, it's West Palm. Yeah. And it's, it's going to be... It's a ritzy area. Yeah. Very, very, very ritzy area, which is really cool. And if we could find another 30 grand hidden in a dresser... How awesome would that be? Number one, do you Probably think we would share. tell you... Okay, so here's the thing. <laughs> I want to know what you guys think. If we found $30,000, do you think we would show that on camera, type a one, if you think we would... Or no, there's no way in Hales they would show that on camera, knowing that it's probably drug money in the area. Type a two. So do you think we would show if we found $30,000 cash? Type a one. If you think we wouldn't, type a two. All right, Justin Brown says two. Ron Starch says two. Storage Scavenger says one. 
uh, because she said says two. Um, so one was yes and one two is yes and two is no. No. And vast majority. Oh, Burt Reynolds lived in Jupiter. Jupiter. Uh, somebody said better show you it. Better show it. I'm seeing a lot of twos though. Yeah. But there are ones too. So Cocky's Flippin' Adventure says two. He, he said it multiple times. He'd probably show that. you three dollars of it. Flippin' Adventure <laughs> says one dollar eventually. Uh, Jeffrey Black says no way you show that. And Paul Malone says for tax purposes no. Uh, <laughs> Justin, actually for tax purposes, if I found it, I would I would declare that for taxes. This is a YouTube video we're talking about. For taxes, I declare all income. So. Um, Let's see. David Drone one two. David Drone said one one two 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 one one one. He's he's typing binary code. One and two. Yeah. So he's saying both. Uh, like maybe, maybe debatable. Italian dragon two two two. I, so here's the thing. It would be very very difficult. Money for Mars has a quick peek. Yes. So like a little peek. What we would probably do, and we have alluded to things like this in the past. If we found that amount of money, there would be little nuances and little uh, alludings in the video that there was something, but we would not show it. Well, let's think about the dude that found seven, was it $7.2 7 million? Point, whatever it was. And if we would- Which says Sanibel Beach is all shells, perfect choice. Exactly. So if we found that type of money, which is crazy, which is crazy to find, uh, knowing so, the area. Well, the guy that found the seven point two million kept his, shared it all over social media. Should have kept then his mouth happened? shut. And then the then the mob, the drug drug lords came after him. So they came after him, and he was only get able to keep a small portion of it. Plus, he had to pay taxes. Did he have to pay taxes on it? Well, you got to pay taxes on any income. This isn't a taxes question. This is a YouTube question. So. YouTube. It backfired on them. Basically, in a nutshell, there are times we find things and we allude to it in a video to where you can come to a conclusion of what was there, but we don't outright show it for specific reasons and purposes. Knowing the area and knowing that it's probably tied to drug money, we would not, we would not show that, but we would probably strongly allude but never show because we would never want that says to come like back. The 1943 copper penny. <laughs> Do you see everybody saying that they found they saw the 1944 steel penny that we have? Whoops. Whoopsies. I didn't. I didn't even know. <laughs> but apparently they do, and I, it's at home right now. So, a good thing we got the new the new security system up. So that would be very difficult as far as we would want to share with you and be excited with you. And yet at the same time, safety has to be taken into consideration as well. And so if we did, that's one of the things when you're watching the videos, you can actually, if you catch on to the alluding and the nuances, you can draw the conclusion of, of what happened. But there are things that sometimes we will not show for specific purposes. And most of that is going to be for our protection. And, but we can elude without, without, you know, breaching any of that protection. You know mm -hmm. what I, you know mm -hmm. what I say? Uh, Kathy White, she says, so do you have to declare the jewelry that you found? You only have to declare the jewelry if you sell it. That's income. Mm -hmm. It's not cash. You have to declare income. That would be cash money in your hands. So you don't declare jewelry. If I were to give you a piece of jewelry right now, you wouldn't have to go to your tax IRS person and go, oh, I declare this. You, if you sold it for a thousand dollars, you have to declare that. Right. One dusty old dude just sent $5. Merry Christmas to all and to all a good Aww, night. Appreciate it. Whoa. Did okay. I do it right this time? Yeah, that was it pretty good. It made a good. noise. That was not bad at all. So keep in mind, uh, within the matter of two days, we will be in Fort Myers mm -hmm. and we will be trying to spend majority of our time on Sanibel Island. And with that being said, 
there is potential that there could be videos every day and there's potential that there could not be videos every day. So we're not gonna push ourselves like we actually have been. We've been pushing and pushing and pushing for almost a year. You've gotten over a, a video. It's Yeah, it's over a year. Over You've gotten a, year. a video every single day. Including the lives every Sunday. Every single day <laughs> lives. Yeah. And that is a tremendous commitment. Uh, YouTube is more than a full-time job. Yeah. And that is not full-time job for us, uh, reselling is. And so there's got to be some type of break somewhere. Now, that doesn't mean that you're not going to get a video. If we go treasure hunting for shells, there's a good chance we're going we're gonna to teach you we're about gonna wanna, shells. We're going to want to share our We're going to share with you and go, oh, look at this. You know, I just found this $100 shell. Or look at this. This shell is so rare because of this. Now, some of you, you may be going, nah, man, that's incredible. I love that. And some of you may be go, oh, man, I want to see what's in the next storage unit. Well, just be ready. There will be more storage units. We're going to keep buying while we're down here in Florida. <laughs> Debbie Vaughn says you spoil us rotten. You know what? If Mick is in Fort Myers, if we buy in Fort Myers, you know who we can give everything to? Mick, you might be getting everything. <laughs> that would be fun. That would be really fun. So all that being said, uh, it's been a hails of a night. Did we forget anything? I don't think so. We just want to wish everyone a very Merry Christmas. And Are we going to go early. live on Christmas? Because she's and already asked. I've already asked them if we're going to go live on Christmas just to kind of hop in and tell everybody Merry Christmas. Most likely we did on Thanksgiving. Yeah, we did Thanksgiving. We for did sure. on Fourth of July. We did 4th of July. We have a habit of doing that on, on, on holidays. holidays. Well, we that's because holidays. you guys are our family. You are yeah. our family. So um, We've been doing that on major holidays. So. Maybe we will. What do you guys, type in the chat a one if you want us to go live on Christmas and a two if you want us to just shut the hails up. <laughs> and enjoy this time off. Time off, we're working. <laughs> All right, we see one, two, one, 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 two, a one, two, a one, one, two, 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 one, 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 two, one, 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 two, one, two, two, one. What do you think? I think the ones probably have it so yeah, far. Yeah, it looks like the majority of the chats say one. Are you ready to sing with me? Yeah. Dashing through the snow. <laughs> and a one-horse open sleigh, or the fields we go. Oh, why are you doing this again? <laughs> <laughs> Laughing all the way up. Bells on bobtails ring. What is a bobtail? No idea. Making, Making spirits bright. What? Fun it is to ride and sing a slain song tonight. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride. You're a mess. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. Yeah, jingle bells, jingle bells. Jingle all the way, yeah. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse, a one horse, one horse open sleigh. Merry Christmas, guys. We love you all. Thank you for joining us. We'll see you soon.